Hello everybody, today I'm going to show you a project in Visual Basic 6. Basically I just save as a .txt extension. This is a text document extension. Okay, what we need to do is in Visual Basic select the standard exe option. And in our form, first we need to create a command button. Reposition this. We're going to call it, we're going to go to the captions area and the properties and we're going to call it create file yeah, it's just spelling is wrong create file and then we're going to create two text boxes put the first one over here I'm just going to push backspace to remove the text within the box and below it I'll create another one same thing, backspace, remove the text. Just going to even out the form a bit. Start the run. Obviously, uh, nothing's going to happen. We have no code in the file. Just going to resize this button a bit, I think. As well as this. Okay. Now we need to start with the coding. We're going to double click on the command box. And we're going to type on the following code dim name file name file equals text one. Okay, so that line basically is a code and all is the code that we can use to give the file that we create on our desktop a, a heading, a name. Whether you call it to do list or your groceries list, it's going to have that, the t this code on the short has a title. Okay, and then below it, the next code is quite long. I'm just going to type it in quick. And once it's done, I'll explain to you what it means. It's actually pretty self-explanatory. If you just watch it. I'm typing with one hand here. I'm using my other one to hold my mic close to my mouth. For some reason it's not too loud today. So just bear with the typing. <coughs> Number one. Okay, so there's a compile error here. So basically, there's something wrong on my line. I'm just gonna. Uh, here we go. I didn't put in the brackets. Ah. Oh. Wait, wait. Being a bit of a retard here. Goes like that. TXT. Close it. There we go. Sorry about that. Okay, so basically what this line does is it sets the output for the file. Which is like you can see the open app path. It's this is this actually links the name with the extension which is .txt. Well, the text extension we're creating so this is quite vital. So whatever the name might be, it'll save it as a .txt extension to the designated root. Okay, to finish the application off, to type on the following. Number one, comma, txt, two dot text. Just press tab to get to the next line. And we're going to close number one. Okay, so there you have it. That's the code we're going to use. I'll close this. And we're going to create this exe. Go file, make exe. I'm just going to leave it as project one. Save and close this down. And here's our exe. So we're going to double click on it. And we're going to give the project a name. Let's go example. And we'll just
just one, two, three, testing. And now we're gonna see if the file creates. There we go. The text file has been created. The name is all matching. Within text documents, we have the same as what I've written here. So anyway, that's the end of this tutorial. Try it out and let me know if you need any help. Enjoy.